if you're coming to Manila and you want the beautiful pool life, if you want to have a gym and all this access, usually you have to pay a lot more money to stay in like a hotel. But there is this place called Azure. Azure? Am I saying that correctly? Azure. Azure. Staycation Resort. And here you can get, you know, their efficiencies essentially. They're really nice, um, but they're basic. And you're going to eat, you can get full access to all kinds of amenities as if you were staying on a high end resort. The rooms, like I said, they're very nice. I'm going to show you right now. And then the grounds, the grounds are absolutely gorgeous. Security everywhere and lots of amenities. So real quick, let's show you the room and then we're going to show you all the good stuff. To give you an idea though, price wise, you can get about $25 a night. It depends on how long you're staying, obviously. And the longer you stay, well, then you trip into a long-term tenancy. Uh, is it two weeks? Uh, three weeks or more. Three weeks or more, then you don't have to pay the $5 fee to use the pool and everything uh, if you are considered a tenant. So stay over three weeks. This might be the place. There are a little bit different in prices. So I don't want anybody to go, wait, you said $25. No, you have to hunt. You got to hunt. There are, most of them are showing up on Airbnb, correct? Uh, we got them on Facebook. Okay, yeah, Facebook, uh, Airbnb, you'll find them all over. Just look for Azure Staycation Resort. You will be able to find them and then try to find the best deal. There is some tips and this is very important. We learned some tips. If you are facing the east, correct? Yeah. The east. Expect a lot of sun, getting really hot, in your, through the windows um, and also a lot of noise from the highway. So try to find ones that are not on the east side. There's a pro tip right there from people who have stayed now in four different ones. We'll be in four total. Yeah. Four, four total. They've stayed in three so far, three different towers, and they are moving into their fourth one for their long-term stay here. So, yep, got to look for the deals, but also make sure you're not on the east side. Okay, let's go look. Now, keeping in mind, they're all individually owned, so people can do whatever they want with them. So this one here does have a stove here, and it's electric, I believe, yeah. and an electric fan. You got a sink here. Was that your French press? Yes. Oh, that's your own. There may be no French press, guys. Uh, a microwave, a fridge. You've got a sofa here. The girl doesn't come with it. Sorry, guys. But, uh, not included. Not included. Extra. A lot of things are extra. It's an amenity. And you see here, because it's like a studio, but you got these for privacy and then curtains that you can close to give yourself some privacy. So that way, if you do have somebody who's staying up a little later, no problem. Or somebody who's sleeping in. I don't, I don't know anybody. I would never sleep in. I, mm. I wouldn't even consider it. Oh. <laughs> or if you're working and you can be on the phone True. out there. And exactly. That's right. That's right. Watch TV in here. Yeah. So as you can see here, everything you possibly need all set up here. Internet was included for you guys on this one? Yes. yes. This was an all-inclusive one, right? Every one of them will be different. Some will say electric's not included, that kind of thing. And then you got a whole balcony here. Not much to show you because they're on the west side, so you don't have the big it's views of the quiet. pools, but it's very, very much peace and quiet type area because you don't have the traffic. And uh, yeah, closet here, amenities Everything. that you would need, TV, and I'm not sure what that is. DVD? <laughs> yeah, it's a DVD player. Look at that. You got some speakers down here. Yeah, I don't know how many DVDs people have anymore. The fan was already here too, right? Yeah. So even though you have AC, you also have a fan because sometimes it's not cold enough or hot enough to have an air conditioner on. So that's nice. So yeah, as you can see, it's quite nice. And for those kind of crazy low prices, that's pretty amazing for a place that has all those amenities. And then just a quick look here, just a standard, as you can see, shower, everything you need. It's very beautiful. Let's go look at the grounds. Well, luck be have it. We just got a big rainstorm, but hey, you can see all the people in the pool. So there's a wave pool here. They got swimming lap pools. They got more pools. Look at that down there. They got a sandy beach down there. Wow. Well, you're getting the lightning and thunder version as you can hear. And then up here on the roof, 
you can see they do have these nice little areas that you can sit out at and have good views of the city as well but look at that view unbelievable and look at the access to the sm mall right here right part of the complex so it's very easy for you to go to the mall look at the views from up here unbelievable I'm getting rained on a lot <laughs> So you're supposed to hang out on rooftops when there's lightning, right? <laughs> That's what I heard. Look at that, you got ten oh basketball courts. You got a basketball courts over there. Wow. That's so amazing. I'm getting poured on. The wave pool runs every hour on the half hour, um, all through the day. So it starts at 10.30. Oh, 8.30. Starts at 8.30 and then goes all the way to 6.30? 7.00 o'clock at night. 6.30, 7 o'clock at night. So if you uh, are looking to go, you can go pretty much any time of the day. Uh, right now, because of the storms, nothing. Nothing is happening right now. You're not allowed in the water because of the lightning. So uh, pretty beautiful though. Even though it's pouring rain, you can have a great time here. Okay, a really cool part about this is the food here and the drinks are actually very economical. Like surprisingly economical. And look at these chicken wings. Look Isn't that beautiful? And it was 200 pesos for how many? No, uh, 400 each. 400 pesos for a, for a dozen chicken wings. So that's a really good price considering you're on a, you're on a resort where you really can't go anywhere else. So they have you and yet they don't take advantage of that. And the drinks are about 180. And you're right on the water. About 180 pesos. Yeah, and you got your wave pool over here that's currently not on because of the thunder. And then you got another pool over here with the beach. It is the best place, it really is. All these mirrors? Hey, get out of the mail locker room. You should know better. <laughs> Here is the movie room for the guests. So you can go in there and watch movies in like a movie theater style. Then you have a games room, and my understanding is they might have PlayStation in here. We're just not sure which PlayStation. All right, so you got... No, okay, they can't cook. We have an air hockey table. You got PS4s all the way down here. It's a little dark, sorry. And you got PS4s lined up along here, so you can play. How cool is that? And a balcony. Very cool. Take a look into the movie room as well. So we're going in there right now. I don't know how many lights will be in there. 
Okay. Yeah, because I can't turn the lights on without getting in trouble because it's closed at the moment. But yeah, as you can so see, look at these people. beautiful leather couches here. And there's the screen. Oh, that's beautiful. And the projector overhead. All right, I like it. What's your favorite workout? Treadmill. Treadmill, all right, treadmill it is. Wow, look at this, look at this. Wow, this is quite lovely. Look at this gym, guys. It's an entire circle. Lovely. Oh yeah, of course, you get to watch the pool while you work out. Hey. Oh, look at that. <laughs> you gonna dance for us? Oh, you gotta light it up, okay. Go girl, go girl. Okay, well, you know, dancing isn't your profession, so we get it. So. Upstairs the restaurant, but it is still closed from the pandemic. Eventually, hopefully it'll reopen. Yeah. How cool. Yeah. This place is absolutely yeah. lovely. So we are not sure how Paris really is related to this, if she's just paid to be an actress or what, but that is called the Paris Beach Club. And there's her picture. So maybe, Maybe. All right, she's gonna do the Paris pose. Who did it better? Are you ready? Who did it better? You're pretty dark right now, by the way. What? She's lit up, you are not. Yin yang, okay? Baby. Okay, yin yang. You're her shadow, that's what you're saying. Her shadow is expensive, I'm sure. I'm sure she's got insurance on it. On her own shadow? Makes yeah. sense. Let's go see that fountain up there, wow. If you are looking for a cheap place to stay here in Metro Manila, this is the place to be. It has everything. Not because the place is cheap in itself, but the prices are so cheap. And it's unfortunate that it rained today because then we would be able to show you the amazing wave pool here. We saw some videos of it on their phone. It looks absolutely incredible. Unfortunate, you'll just have to imagine it. And then, that's actually clear right over there. So anybody in that pool can stand along the edge or swim and you can see over the edge. You can see off in the distance there, now that it's beautiful at night, you can see the Manila Airport, and that's the strip. And some planes are coming in on the far end there. 